Oop. I almost tripped. So, uh, we are in Nuwara area and uh, our destination is the Moon Plains. We've been driving from 3 o'clock in the morning and we are traveling with a one-year-old. This is gonna be exciting. You can't take your vehicle all the way to Moon Plains. Uh, there's a place that we have to park here and then we have to take this. I'm not sure whether you guys can hear me well with this wind that's like a crazy wind happening right now I'm sure that it can take me away if it's like increases a bit more because I, I already feel I'm moving look at this So this is the only place that I can find where there's no wind. If you go up like this, that's wind. We are currently at 6,438 feet above the sea level. And this is why this place is much more special. This is, the, this is the one place, I think this is the only place that you can have a 360 view of uh, the uh, uh, of like in a whole Sri Lankan prominent places. Now that I found a less windy place, uh, let me uh, attend to some of the questions that people have asked about moon planes uh, when I looked up the place. Uh, number one about the charges. It's 50 bucks, 50 rupees per local per head and it's 400 bucks for foreigners. And uh, you cannot take your vehicle into the park. I will explain that why because I asked the question why. Uh, you can't take the vehicle therefore you need to take a, shuff, a safari jeep from the ticket counter to the actual moon plane moon plane uh, location so that is 2000 bucks I think it can accommodate about eight people so even if it is one people two people three people up to eight people it's 2000 bucks now to the important question uh, why you cannot take your vehicle even though you have a four-wheel drive you cannot take your vehicle there and they won't allow you to do that uh, the reason behind is the moon plane the location that we went is situated in middle of the Sri Lanka's one and only potato seeding facility right so they are being very careful what goes in and what goes out of the uh, out of the facility so they don't want any foreign biological non-biological things creeping in through vehicles through people into the uh, facility so that's what the explanation was why you cannot take your vehicle there uh, because even the safari jeeps they don't go out of the park they are rotating in, around in and in the park and they never go out of the park for anything so that's the reason right the next stop Gregory's Lake this place is amazing I haven't been here I have gone around this place but never visited this place. Now I got the chance to visit this place. This place looks amazing. Look at this place. Okay. 
Any comments about this whole thing? Boy. Exactly. Boy. Uh huh.